Here is another colon, as you could see. Here's a large blood vessel within pericolonic fatty tissue. Here's the serosa or adventitia, depending on whether this was part of the colon that was retroperitoneal or not. Here is a large, thick muscular layer of smooth muscle. Here is a submucosa. Here is a mucosa. And here's a large ulcer, as you could see, because there's complete absence not only of epithelium, but of the entire mucosa. So let's look around a little bit. And uh, the first thing we notice is that, oh, there's even some inflammatory cells scattered out here in the um, adventitia or serosa. The muscle appears nice, smooth, uniform. Uh, the submucosa here is totally infiltrated by inflammatory cells, has a thick fibrin coat along its surface uh, where the uh, mucosa has been completely lost. It's a very whopping uh, inflammatory reaction. It extends into the submucosa and mucosa of the adjacent area where there is no ulceration. You can see a lot of submucosal destruction here, and you can see a lot of hemorrhage and inflammation within the mucosa as well. Uh, what could this be? Well, it could be a lot of things. It's a very significant colitis. And if you had a lot of time and you were to uh, look at this and you had a good eye, you might come to an area like this in which you could see within this uh, destroyed submucosal area little guys like this and this and probably here's the best one over here these are amoebas quite frankly you'd probably miss them unless you were really looking for them you might think oh that's just a piece of smudge or maybe a macrophage amoebas do look like macrophages they're about the right size they have a granular cytoplasm uh, and uh, if you didn't uh, suspect it, you could totally miss these things. This is amoebic colitis. With time, this could be so significant, uh, it could result in uh, the amoebas even settling into organs like liver. And I think that probably uh, virtually 90-something percent of all cases of amoebic liver abscesses are from amoeba colitis. And I think with, with time, enough significant uh, amoeba colitis uh, could lead into a liver abscess as well, in which you can see the amoebas. Thank you very much.